I'm going to wrap this up by talking about a new exciting feature that we're looking to get into 8.8, .8, something we call hierarchical workspaces. But I'll start by explain, explaining, first of all, what a workspace is. So a workspace is this isolated place on your site where you can work on multiple changes uh, at, one, at one time and publish them at the same time. Hierarchical workspaces then enables multiple workspaces to, to play together. Imagine you run a magazine and you, you want to start preparing your winter issue with lots of draft content. Um, but at the same time, you want to start preparing your New Year issue. New Year happens during winter, at least in the Northern Hemisphere. Um, so you want to work on these things at the same time. So the way it works is that published content is automatically inherited downwards so that Grace and, and Margaret here in this case can kind of work on these changes together where Margaret inherits all the changes that Grace is working on in the winter issue. And then they can merge and publish changes upstream. upstream. And I'm going to uh, show a demo here in just a moment. So on the left, we have the live workspace. We'll switch over to the winter issue workspace in just a moment. And on the left, we have uh, Margaret. She's working on the new year issue workspace. So we're going to start by making some changes um, in the winter issue uh, workspace. The changes that Grace is uh, doing here will be automatically inherited down to the new year issue so that, Mar so that Margaret on the right-hand side can work on her new year uh, things at the same time. So we're saving these changes, uploading a new image, and we can preview this one change or multiple other changes uh, at one time. And if we reload this child workspace effectively, we can see that the changes have been inherited downstream. So now Margaret, in this New Year issue workspace, she's going to do some additional changes. She wants to start preparing for New Year's, so she's going to remove uh, a redundant article from the front page and do some changes to this uh, lovely milk chocolate recipe here. So we're changing the title and, and doing a, another few bits and pieces. And what's important to understand here is that the changes done uh, downstream here will not leak upwards, so to speak, to, to the parent workspace. So we can uh, review all of these multiple changes uh, together. So we can see the changes here. And if we reload the winter issue workspace on the left-hand side, we won't see those changes there yet because the workspaces aren't merged yet. So you can see how they differ at this time. If we're happy, uh, we maybe want to then bring together these changes and start publishing them. So what we can do here is that we merge this content upstream. We see that there's two changes. We removed the uh, uh, article from the front page, and we updated an image. And we can now see that these downstream changes are now reflected upstream after that merge. And now if we want to go ahead and publish this, three changes will be published. The one workspace, the, uh, the one change that Grace already did, along with the two other that Margaret worked on. We can go and these changes that we've been talking about should then be if we switch to the live workspace here. And that's it.